Professional English Proficiency Certification. Module 21. Narration. Learning Objectives. Doctor Help Learners Understand the Art of Narrative. Doctor Make the Students Practice Narrating Stories with the Right Tone. Doctor Provide Sample Narratives for Clarity and Understanding. Doctor Make Students to Present Their Narratives. Narration is an art. All cannot be successful at narration. In the good old days, when there was no TV, children used to flock around grandparents to listen to stories of mythical heroes, kings and princes, gods and goddesses. Their narrative was so powerful that the children were overawed and numbstruck. All moral stories across cultures and geographies come under the genre of the narrative. All moral stories across cultures and geographies come under the genre of the narrative. In the narrative, the listeners are wonderstruck and elevated to the new world of fantasy, charm and magic. In India, we can find powerful narrative in Varmaki's Ramayana and Vyasa's Mahabharata, which have handed over the rich traditions and values from times immemorial to this day. In English literature, powerful narrative poetry came from Samuel Taylor Coleridge whose poem Rhyme of the Ancient Mariner stands apart for all times to come. Whose poem Rhyme of the Ancient Mariner stands apart for all times to come. In English, narration has been a powerful tool when it comes to explaining about an occasion or event. The objective of a narrative is not only to arouse curiosity but also entice the listener or reader into a never-ending charm and delight. Narratives provide visuals in words with the listener visualizing the actual happening as they took place. Well. The magnitude of each narrative impact varies from person to person, their focus and individual attention. Rabbit and the Tortoise There was a rabbit which prided over its abilities to run fast. These was a tortoise that carried out its work at its own pace. The tortoise wanted to teach the rabbit a lesson, it challenged the rabbit for a race. The tortoise kept moving slowly towards the end point, it could reach the goal on time. The rabbit was humiliated as it lost the race. Moral, it is confidence in one's self and not overconfidence that wins the race. Chalet, Hindi movie. This film is an action thriller released in the year 1975. In the small village of Ramgarh, the retired policeman Thakur Baldf Singh summons to a pair of small-time thieves that he had once arrested. Thakur feels that the duo Veru and Jai would be ideal to help him capture Gabba Singh, a dacoit wanted by the authorities for a 50,000 reward. The two thieves thwart the dacoits sent by Gabba to extort the villagers. Soon afterwards, Gabba and his goons attack Ramgar during the festival of Holi, and in a tough battle, Veru and Jai are cornered. Thakka, although he has a gun within his reach, does not help them. Veru and Jai fight back and the bandits flee. The two are, however, upset at Thakka's inaction, and consider leaving the village. Thakka explains that Gabba had killed nearly all of his family members, and cut off both his arms a few years earlier, which is why he could not use the gun. He had concealed the dismemberment by always wearing a shawl. 
he had concealed the dismemberment by always wearing a shawl. Living in Ramgarh, the lively Veru and cynical J.I. find themselves growing fond of the villagers. Veru is attracted to Basanti, a feisty, talkative young woman who makes her living by driving a horse cart. J.I. is drawn to Radha, Thakur's reclusive, widowed daughter-in-law, who subtly returns his affections. Skirmishes between Gabba's gang and J.I. Veru finally result in the capture of Veru and Basanti by the Dacoits. J.I. attacks the gang, and the three are able to flee Gabba's hideout with Dacoits in pursuit. Fighting from behind a rock, J.I. and Veru nearly run out of ammunition. Veru, unaware that J.I. was wounded in the gunfight, is forced to leave for more ammunition. Meanwhile, J.I., who is continuing the gunfight single-handedly, decides to sacrifice himself by using his last bullet to ignite dynamite sticks on a bridge from close range, himself by using his last bullet to ignite dynamite sticks on a bridge from close range. Veru returns, and J.I. dies in his arms, enraged. Veru attacks Gabba's den and catches the dacoit. Veru nearly beats Gabba to death when Thakur appears and reminds Veru of the promise to hand over Gabba alive. Thakur uses his spikes old shoes to severely injure Gabba and destroy his hands. The police then arrive and arrest Gabba. After J.I.'s funeral, Veru leaves Ramgarh and finds Basanti waiting for him on the train. Radu is left alone again, 